Hi. In this tutorial, we will see how we can relocate uh, the pivot point of an object to certain specific locations. Um, as you know, you can go to hierarchy panel and uh, relocate the position manually to anywhere we like. But we can also go to edit, transform toolbox. Here we have some options, but we will focus on this section here related to the pivot point. So for example, uh, if I click center, the pivot point will jump to the, uh, to the uh, geometric center of the object. Now, this works uh, basically based on the, pivot, uh, the bounding box of the object. A bounding box is like a virtual box that, go, that uh, encompasses the whole uh, the geometry. So you can imagine from the top viewport that it goes from this side to this side to here and the front viewport. You can imagine the box going from here to here to here and then here and here. So, okay. Now, so the, the pivot point is now in the center. So, uh, let's say I want to make a jump to the minimum X. So, I can click on the minimum here and click X. <coughs> so now it is in the far left. If I choose max and x, it will go to the far right. And it's still in the mid. Now I can keep it on max and click the z axis. So it's now in the highest level. If you click mini min, click Z again, it's in the lowest level. And while it's here, I can take it to the min Y, min and Y. So now it's here. And the max Y. Max Z. So you get the idea. You, we have this one here. It's called origin. This will uh, relocate the pivot to the origin, the zero zero zero. In case you need that. Now we have this thing here, center. I will manually relocate the pivot away from the object. So wh what this means, instead of, you know, when you click center, it will go to the geometric center in the X, Y, and Z uh, directions. But when you click center here, and you specify an axis. For example, if I click the X axis, the pivot will move to the center, but only on the X axis. It doesn't go to the geometric center on the X, Y, and Z. For example, here, for example, I will click X. So it's, it's here. If I click y, it will be here. So uh, basically that's it for this tutorial. Hope you like it. If you do, pl please press the like button and subscribe to the channel and see you in the next video. Thank you.